Hey, what's up, Easy here. This is how you delete an OEM partition. Now, if you try to do this the regular way, when you right-click on it, it will just say help. You don't actually have any options. So, the first thing you need to do is go into Disk Management, and do that by going to Start Menu and typing Disk Management, and then clicking on Create and Format Hard Disk Partitions. Inside here, you want to verify the number that Windows has assigned to the disk. In my case, that is Disk 5. So now, you want to go back to Start Menu, and type disk part one word and it should bring up disk part.exe this will bring up a dos command prompt and inside here you type list disk and this will show you a similar thing to disk management once again verify that you're on the right disk because you can mess some things up like this so then type select disk and then the number of the disk now type list partition and it will list both the partitions or however many you have and one should be labeled OEM. Now type select partition and the number of that partition. Now type delete partition override. Now if you watch disk management as you hit enter you should see that OEM partition become unallocated space now. So from here you can just right click the other partition of the drive and expand volume if you already have files on that drive or you can just delete that partition to create uh, all unallocated space and create a, a new volume out of that unallocated space. So that's it. If this video helped you, make sure you hit that like button.